Eat and rate a celebrity's restaurant? This could become a new series, but let's eat. Overall, 7.5 out of 10. Eating and rating celebrity restaurants and you guys want Mr. Beast Burger. Let's see how this goes. Overall rate, five out of 10. Eating and rating a celebrity's restaurant for the whole day, we got David Dobrik's Pizzeria. Let's get saucy. This is my first time ever trying Dobrik's and we're doing it for the whole day. So we are in for a ride, folks. A lot of pizza is gonna be consumed. Starting it off with the hot honey pepperoni, pouring the honey, dousing it all over. The crunch was phenomenal. The pepperoni was good. Starting off the day, great. Spicy vodka pasta. Pasta just doesn't belong on pizza, to be honest. And then just a nice good old cherry slushy to start it off the day. Hawaiian pizza, same with pepperoni and ham. Get off pizza. And then the Chicago one. I'm from Chicago, so this was a rating. It was an okay Chicago win. Veggie pizza, just don't put veggies on pizza, period. Blue Moon ice cream. You can't go wrong. It's good. Not bad. It's good. Supreme pizza is all right. I'm not a big olive fan myself. And same with those banana peppers on the meat lovers. Not necessary. Just leave it to the meat. The meat does all the carrying and overall, overall rate. 6.9 out of 10. Eating and rating a celebrity's restaurant. Today we got Jonah's Kebabs. Let's see if he'll put me on a kebab. Wait, wait. Alrighty, ready? Overall rate, 8.5 out of 10. Eating and rating a celebrity's restaurant. Today we got Mark Wahlberg's Wahlburgers. Let's see if this makes me jacked. Mark Wahlberg is absolutely jacked. So I don't know if it's the gym or these dang Wahlburgers, but look at that, man. We're starting off the day with tater tots. Got to get the carbs in. Throw it up, catch it in the mouth. That's what we do. And then a small burger. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> Burger for breakfast, gotta love it. Now lunch, we have the Fiesta Burger. This one was uh, not very much of a Fiesta, but I, I thought it was pretty dang good, to be honest. But Paul's Crispy Chicken Sandwich, I was shocked with the chicken sandwich. It's called Wahlburgers, but their chicken was unreal. Pulled the part, perfect. Same with the mac and cheese. It was bacon mac and cheese, even better. And the Impossible Burger, um, yeah, it was all right for an Impossible Burger, to be honest. Tasted pretty normal, which is what I like to see. Then we had a strawberry shake, and, and coming with the overall rate, here we go. Overall rate, 8.4 out of 10. 
eating and rating a celebrity's restaurant. Today we got Shaquille O'Neal's Big Dick It and Big Chicken restaurant. Let, let's eat. Mm. Overall rate, 7.1 out of 10. Eating and rating a celebrity's restaurant. Today we have LeBron James's Blaze Pizza. Hopefully this doesn't affect LeBron's legacy. Eating and rating a celebrity's restaurant. Today we have Kevin Hart's Vegan Heart House. Hopefully this food doesn't fall short of the expectation. Mm-hmm. 